The, 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 even the speech last night with Hillary, it's so frustrating, Mike and Willie, but I'll start with you, Willie, it's so frustrating just watching Hillary Clinton. Her speech last night was, I'll get the things done. I'll get the thing. Like, what are your issues? Why are you running? Whether we have her on this show when we interview her or we see she that gives speech really last long night. Lists. It's basically the same argument that some of the Republican yeah. side have who's, whose Mug chances have collapsed. He can win. Remember Rick Santorum while you're supporting because he can win. Right. That's not enough Tom for voters. What do Iowa. you stand for? You know, it was interesting watching Hillary Clinton's speech, and we'll play some of it in a few minutes. The degree to which Bernie Sanders has shaped the conversation Message. in this race. Hillary Clinton, famous centrist and moderate and all those things, sounded like a social justice warrior last night, talking about the things that Bernie Sanders has been talking about his whole life. Hillary Clinton now is following Bernie, Bernie Sanders' lead in this race. I don't know how she closes the gap. The Clintons left here last night in the middle of the night, having lost this state that's been so critical to their careers. They left with one underlying real danger signal out there, and Steve was just alluding to it. Berlin, New Hampshire, Lebanon, New Hampshire, working class towns, white working class women were an automatic for Hillary Clinton for years, an automatic for Bill Clinton for years, no longer an automatic. She lost. And that's a lot of dynamics to that. She lost women by 11 points. Yeah. Now, we, we will... We'll be looking at that closer coming up. Coming up on